Well, you guys know what that is. I'm at work again. Alright. Here we go. I'm pulling pins again. You know, I've had people ask me what I'm concentrating on, what I'm doing. So guys, I want to tell you what I'm doing. And I'm getting ready to change your entire outlook on life. Alright, we're going to talk about the word scrap. All right, and for now on, every time you hear the word scrap, I want you to think of the word goal. When you hear the word scrap, you're going to think of the word goal. When you think of the word goal, I want you to hear, I want you to think of the word dreams. So scrap is going to equal goal, and goal is going to equal dreams, and dreams you're going to think of reality. All right. We're going to work hard and we're going to focus on our life. You know, a lot of people, uh, I've had a few comments about asking me why I don't just stop right now and uh, go after my dream. Well, I've got a schedule to follow. Okay. Um, <clears throat> You guys may not know what I'm walking away from here. I get free health insurance. I get $38,000 a year to walk through that door and basically do nothing. I sit at a desk and I run a team of about uh, 25 people. And they do what I tell them. You know, uh, the only time I actually have to work is when I get up and I want to work. Which is every day I miss hard work. Um, but, you know, this isn't my dream, you know, of being here. Uh, it was at one time, a long time ago, you know, back in my 20s, I wanted this job. But now I want something bigger for my family. So, scrap, you know, it's such a dirty word. You know, it really is scrap metal. Uh, but... That's why we're going to attach scrap to goals. Guys, you got to have goals in your life. You know, if you're waking up and you don't have goals, you know, you're not going to work as hard as you need to work. All right, so attach that word scrap to goals. And goals, we're going to attach to the word dreams because... When you have a goal, it will produce your dreams. Um, you know, all of the uh, big guys that you've ever heard of or ever known about, uh, Henry Ford, Steve Jobs, Bill Gates, uh, William Buffett, Warren Buffett, sorry, uh, they all have goals. You know, and these are some of the richest men in America. Uh, Steve Jobs, he's killed accidentally. Rest his soul. But, uh, you know, they started with a goal. And, guys, they don't have to be big. You know, maybe you're having a hard time in life and your, uh, your goal is just paying the uh, water bill, paying the light bill, something like that. You know what? It doesn't matter what it is. Write it down. Put it on a piece of paper and make it a reality. All right. And as soon as you write it down, you know, look and see if there's anything from here to there that you got to work on, like miniature goals. Okay. Write those down and then go out and do one. All right. A lot of guys on here talking a lot of crap but they're not going after their dream. I'll tell you what, I am. And it's not a dream. It is a reality. And I am focused on it. I get up every day. It's one of the first things I think about. It's one of the last things I think about when I go to bed at night. Um, but I wanted to make this video so that you guys could feel this intense drive that I have right now. I want to share this secret with you. 
writing down your goals will make a reality for you. It will turn your life upside down in a good way. Um, you know, I used to uh, I used to watch TV a lot. You know, I watch maybe uh, maybe an hour or two hours of uh, videos a day now. But as far as regular TV goes, no, I don't even watch it. Don't even waste my time with it. You know why? Because those guys are on there making money, following their dreams. You know, you got to remember that. Yeah, do we need a little bit of entertainment in our lives? Yes, that's fine. But to come home, sit down in front of the damn TV for six hours a day, that makes no sense. Think about that. Um, you know, think of the word scrap. Think of the word goals. Think of the word goals. Think of the word dreams. All right. When you write down that goal, to make that a reality... If anything happens during the day, focus on the goal. You have a flat tire, so what? Get your tools out of the trunk, and while you're changing that tire, think about your goal. Have a fight with the old lady, go out, calm down, and while you're working in the garage or whatever, focus on that goal. Once you've calmed down, go inside, tell the old lady you're, you're sorry. Doesn't matter if it was your fault or her fault. Fix that. You know why? Because she's there behind you. All right. Um, you guys, latch on to your goals. Make that, uh, make it what you think about when you first get up in the morning. Last thing you think about when you go to bed at night. So, uh, all right, that was, uh, that's my little rant. I uh, didn't mean to get real serious there, but but I really did, you know. Uh, I've been watching a lot of you guys on here, and you guys watch me. And, uh, you know, I want to see all of us succeed. You know, and there's plenty of room in this world for all of us to take our little piece of the pie out. But in order for us to do that, we got to focus on our dreams. And the way we do that is every time we hear the word scrap, it's going to make us think of goals. And every time we hear the word goals, it's going to make us think of our dreams. What are your dreams? Mike's out of here.